there, I'm Barry, Barry Buzz, and this is Buzz. Tonight we have an exciting show ahead of us, with a little bit of a European twist, as all of our contestants are from the EU. Now, let's hear a little bit about them. And this is our contestant from France. Bonjour, je m'appelle Amélie, j'habite dans la capitale de France, Paris. And now let's meet our contestant from Spain. Hola, me llamo Rosalina y soy de Madrid. And now our final contestant from Scotland. Hi, I'm Andrew, I'm from Glasgow, I play the bagpipes and I study music. Okay, now let's begin. We're going to start off with a video clip from France about the EU and how it helps students. Un grand avantage des jeunes dans l'Union Européenne est le programme Erasmus. Ça permet chaque année à 200 000 étudiantes d'étudier et de faire un stage à l'étranger. 33. That's correct. Mi hermano mayor está en Suiza este año a causa de Erasmus. Qui souhaite. La France et la République. Les institutions de gouvernement de la France sont définies par la Constitution et en plus précisément par la Constitution actuelle, la Cinquième République. Now, Rosalina, and what about Spain? Espagne est une monarchie constitutionnelle gouvernée par de la Constitution de 1978. El rey que es el jefe de estado puede ratificar leyes, disolver la legislatura y proponer candidatos para el cargo de primer ministro. Great, okay, now we're moving on to our next question, and this time we've got a clip from the UK. In January 2012, politicians clashed over whether they had the power to hold a referendum on independence. A campaign for independence has begun and will take place in 2014. Scotland. Well done. Now we're all equal in one point each. I feel like this is going to be a close one. España. Well done, Spain. Now you're starting to edge ahead a little. Ole, ole, ole. Now, Andrew, what about Scotland's culture? Scotland is famous for bagpipes and cults. Scotland is full of culture and history. The one thing I love about Scotland is the annual Edinburgh Fringe Festival that happens in August. It really brings the city to life. Great. Now, in France? La plupart des gens associent la culture française avec Paris. Ce qui, la centre de la monde, la mode, la culture, l'art et l'architecture. Okay, now we're in our final round and the scores are all tied at seven. Now, for the final question. What country is the best in the EU? <laughs> We've had an amazing night tonight and we hope you did too. We'll see you next time on Buzz. Au revoir! Adios!